Hello my All City Kids, I am back to help you through this recorder part for All City. Now, we've been chosen to do Soprano Recorder 2, which means we are going to be playing with another part that has different notes. So we need to make sure that we have ours lined up, okay? So it's in 5-4, so the first two beats are um, empty, and then we'll play 3 and 4 and 5. Okay, that's the rhythm for the first couple of measures. The notes that you're going to need, E, G, and C. Remember, C is just thumb and the middle finger on top. Okay, so E, G, C. And it sounds like this. Okay. Try that pattern one more time. Remember, it's E, G, C. Ready, and one, two, one, two. Then you're going to go to F. Now, F is a little trickier. To find F, if you're uncomfortable with it, you can put all of your fingers down, including your pinky, on the bottom two tone holes. And you're going to simply lift your middle finger on your bottom right hand, and it's going to give you an F natural. Now the F is temperamental. If you don't have your trios correct, then that F is not going to come out correct. Okay? So I'm going from F to A back to that high C. So watch again. F, A, C. It's the same rhythm as the E. So rest, 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 rest. So if you notice, the pattern is just going back from the E pattern to the F pattern to the E pattern to the F pattern. Looking at your music, the handout I gave you, you're going to start on the E pattern. And it happens the E pattern, F pattern, E pattern, F pattern, E pattern, F pattern. And then it keeps going until they get to uh, verse 3 where the voice comes in. Mama Salomon. And then we're going to have the third pattern, okay? The third pattern starts on a G. And you're going to move up and down G, A, G, F, E. Now the trickiest part is the F, E. So let me put my hand really close to this. So you go G, A, G, F, E. It's called a switch. So F to E requires me to lift two fingers while simultaneously putting down the middle finger. Okay? Watch again. G, A, G, F, E. Watch again slowly. G, A, G, F, E. If I play it slowly. Okay? You gotta have your fingers close to the keys so you're ready to move, okay? If you have them way up here, then it's more motion to get to the keys. So keep them close to the keys. Okay, that's the first pattern in that second section. So let's do that one more time. Talk through the notes. G, A, G, F, E. Now let's play it. Now that's quite slow because it's eighth notes. It's again on beat three. Three and four and five. Okay. One, two. One, two. So spend some time with that one. Okay. If you need to pause and go back to the certain section, then do so and work on them. The next pattern goes up instead of down. So we're going to start on the A. And it goes. A, G, A, B flat, C. Now I find this one the most difficult because from the B flat to the C, it's a full switch, okay? I have four fingers down the B flat, okay? Is one, skip, three, one, skip, three, okay? If you're having trouble, put your D down and lift both middle fingers. That's your B flat, okay? So here we go, slowly, A, G, A, B flat, C. Just one more time, A, G, A, 
B flat, C. I'm going to play it very slowly. Listen again. And that is that second pattern. Now, once you get good, go back, try it, practice it. Then we can put it to tempo. One, two. Okay. Now, just like before, the E and the F alternated. These two patterns alternate. Okay. It happens once. It happens. Sorry, look at the music. Twice. Three. three times and the fourth time it changes on you. So let's do it three times, okay? Remember the first pattern. The fourth time it's going to go G, A, G, F, E, a, G, A, G, F. So this is the very ending. So that's the very end. I'm going to do the ending one more time. Okay. 